I found 15 entry level work from home jobs and all of these you can make really good money. We're talking 70, 80, 90, even 100,000 plus dollars per year. And most of these you've probably never heard of. So if you appreciate me doing videos like this, let me know by gently tapping that like button and let's go ahead and get into this one. So first one on the list is going to be a data annotation specialist. Now, the reason I mentioned this one is because anything involved with data is incredibly valuable right now. You probably heard that data is more valuable than oil or gold, and it's true. And this is basically a role where you're going to be labeling data. And this not only helps your company use the data, but it also helps AI to use the data too. And right off the bat, just starting off without a college degree, without any previous experience, you can make about $46,000 a year or more. And there's some specialized positions where you're going to be working with AI where you can make a lot more than that. So I really like this one. I think it's great. It's a great way to get your foot in the door when it comes to working with data as well. And there are a lot more jobs down the line that can pay way more than this one. So I'll give this one a nine out of 10 opportunity score. Next on the list is going to be a delivery manager. And this is basically where you make sure that technological projects transition smoothly all the way from concept to reality. And this is kind of like project management mixed with information technology skills. And this is one where you do not need to have a college degree and in some cases you don't have to have experience and you'll make around hundred and thirty seven thousand dollars a year so it pays really well I want that I want that so overall I'm gonna give this one a 9 out of 10 opportunity score next is gonna be one of my favorites and that is YouTube scriptwriter so almost every YouTube channel you see out there uses scripts, right? So that's how you make a well-researched and engaging video. And writing the scripts for those videos takes a very long time. And at this point, there's hundreds of thousands of different creators out there, many of them on YouTube or other platforms. And if you can save them 10 or 15 hours a week when it comes to their script writing or just help them with the research, they're gonna pay you very well for that. He's got money, money, money. And here's an article about a guy who makes over $5,000 a month writing scripts for YouTubers. And this is getting more and more common. Now, because of the fact that this is a relatively new career. There's no data on the internet that says exactly how much you can make. But if you're really good at this, you can easily get into the six figures. So I think there's a lot of different content related jobs and just jobs in the creator economy in general that are going to be blowing up in the next five to 10 years. So this is a huge opportunity and this is the best time to get into it at the ground level. Well, what are we waiting for? So I'm going to give this one a nine out of 10 opportunity score. Next on the list is going to be a provider engagement coordinator. This is another one of those thousands of little random medical related careers that you can get into. And you're basically going to be coordinating different healthcare related tasks that providers like doctors, for instance, do. And this is one where you don't need to get a college degree and it pays $46,000 a year right off the bat. And you can make much more than that down the line. So it's another really solid little healthcare related career that you can get into very easily. I'll give this one an eight out of 10 opportunity score. Next is going to be an Excel sheet specialist. And this is exactly what it sounds like. You're basically going to be using Excel in order to organize data. And there are a ton of different careers, industries, types of businesses that you can do this in. And Excel experts make about $62,000 a year. So this is a pretty good one. I'll give it a 7.5 out of 10 opportunity score. Next is going to be a talent development coordinator. And basically you're gonna be in charge of developing the talent at a company. I find talent an attractive quality in a friend. So you're going to be handling tasks like internships, partnerships, performance reviews, and HR data insights. And data shows that organizations that have a strong onboarding process improve new hire retention by 82% and productivity by over 70%. So yeah, this is pretty important. And they make about $56,000 a year. Plus you can make a lot more than that down the line. So this is a pretty good one. I'll give it an eight out of 10 opportunity score. Next is another really good one. And this is more business related. And that is going to be high ticket sales. And and this is the art of selling high ticket products and services that are priced very high. And you typically will get some kind of commission when you sell it, something like 15%. But there's lots of different types of high ticket sales out there. For instance, real estate is technically a type of high ticket sales. Also selling a $100 million yacht is also high ticket sales. And on average, you make about $122,000 a year doing this. So yeah, this is a really good one. Not for everyone. Sales, let's just be honest, it's not going to be for everyone. But if you have the right type of personality and the right mentality, this can be amazing. I'll give it a 9.5 out of 10 opportunity score. And by the way, one of the best types of high ticket sales is going to be in the technology industry. And the way you'd get started with this is working as a BDR or business development representative. And you'd basically be selling software contracts to other companies that can sometimes be worth six or even seven figures. And I've interviewed a bunch of people on this channel that have gotten into this position and they all did it through my friend Troy's company. And he does have a free training, which I'll put down in the description, as well as the pinned comment below if you're interested in checking it 
it out. Next on the list is going to be a digital media planner. And they're basically like the navigators of the online advertising world. And they pinpoint exactly where ads should land and negotiate the best spots across digital platforms. And they make about $76,000 a year. So this is another really good one you can get into. I'll give it a nine out of 10 opportunity score. Next is going to be a web content editor. And this is basically where you're gonna be overseeing all different types of written content that ends up on the web. So things for a brand like blog posts, Instagram carousels, as well as tweets. And they make about $57,000 a year. So this is another really good one. I'll give it a 7.5 out of 10 opportunity score. Next is going to be a cybersecurity analyst. And just about anything cybersecurity related is extremely hot right now. And basically you're gonna be protecting companies' data. And you can make about $97,000 a year in this position. That's real money. That's. So yeah, really good one. I'll give it a 9.5 out of 10 opportunity score. Next is gonna be an e-commerce listing specialist. And this is basically where you do the copywriting for different e-commerce listings, and you're gonna be working on the art on the listing as well. And they make really good money at about $63,000 a year. So another really good one, I'll give it an eight out of 10 opportunity score. Next is going to be a community engagement manager. All right, so I'm trying to keep this one under 10 minutes, so I'm gonna go really fast here. Sorry if I missed some details, but this is exactly what it sounds like. You're basically just just making sure that the community that you're working with stays engaged. There's a lot of products these days where you pay monthly and you're just a part of a community or a membership and they make about $79,000 a year. So this can be a really good one. Memberships and communities are getting more and more common. So I'll give this one an eight out of 10 opportunity score as well. Next is going to be an advertising specialist. So this is where you're gonna be specializing in a type of paid ads typically. So something like Google pay-per-click or Facebook ads. And this is obviously super valuable. You have to know the analytical side of things, but you also also might have to know the creative side of things too. And they make about $68,000 a year. So I'll give this one a nine out of 10 opportunity score. Next is going to be a remote event planner. And again, this is exactly what it sounds like during the pandemic. We had lots of different remote events. Some of them had over 100,000 people. And that takes a lot of planning and coordination because the last thing you want to happen is your servers to go down and all those people lose connection. And in this position, you make about $56,000 a year. So I'll give this one an 8.5 five out of 10 opportunity score. And lastly, you have a paid media specialist. So this is very similar to the advertising specialist, and you might work with many different types of paid media. One of them, for instance, might be working with different influencers and doing sponsorships or brand deals. And in this position, you make about $54,000 a year. So I will also give this one a nine out of 10 opportunity score. Now, if you haven't checked it out already, check out the 17 work from home job companies that are almost always hiring. And you can check that out by clicking right here.